Hello there, welcome to Armored Warfare with me, McFadden. Okay, this is the final pre-prepared video. Um, by now, I'm probably falling asleep somewhere in a park. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's Facebook again. Curse it. Curse it in Bod's own name. Uh, anyway, yes, so let's do this and keep our fingers crossed. Um, I've taken out the Leo 2A7140. It's a tier 10 match. It's on high wall. I like high wall. One of my favourite maps. I have no idea how well this is going to go. The word badly is floating around my head. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. So, I'm going to go left here. Driver, move out. The good thing about the Leopard is it has that manoeuvrability to it. But, unlike World of Tanks, when you can have four or five shots at you, and even then you might be okay, here shots hurt. There's no two ways about it. And it worries me that everyone's going that way. Why is everyone going that way? What do they know that I don't? Well, sod you, I'm going this way. Have we got any arty? No, we don't. Oh, what? Really? Do I turn round? No, sod it. I'm not going to turn round. Yeah, I know, I'm the one poor sad git going, Oh, somebody help me! Well, no, I've made my choice. It's probably going to go up top or down below. Oh, who unto Rassel's Tower would go? Who will go up top? Can't be shot down from. Okay. This is a good tank. I don't know if you saw the review I did of it um, last week. But very much like it. And there we go. Hi, honey. Okay, took out his ammo. Well, his gun, I think, or his, his loading device. Yeah, dude, you come to me. You come to your Auntie Siobhan. Come on. I'm not going to go toe to toe with you. You've got that huge ass gun. That's a T49 Arta, so. Come on, come on, come on. Identify target. Hostile tank. Move back. Yeah, you see. Difficult. APS knocked down a shot. Identified. Hostile tank. Whoa, where did he come from? Pull back, run away, and do other stuff. Oh, we're taking it here. Okay. APS up. Good, good. No Take it back. Watch out from the rear. There's a crab down there. Okay, the Abrams is that. Whether he's going to succeed or not, I don't know. I'm actually tempted to pull back and help him. Use that manoeuvrability. Come here. There we go. I am not going to survive this. And I'll tell you why. I'm completely outnumbered. From both sides. I've been outflanked. What do you mean no effect? Arr! Try and use the rest of that tank to cover my ass. There it is. Okay, fair enough. I can live with that. That happens. Though I've got to admit, I'm not impressed by my teammates there. As someone said, when you've got two tanks against seven... Oh, how's this going to go? I honestly don't know. That monster gun on the Amata. Seriously, PLO-1, get round its side. It's got weak armour on the side. It really does. Or you could just... 
fall off a cliff. I don't know. I don't know how to respond to that. Okay. What's that Leo doing? Does he know what he's doing? This is the question. He's at the top end. He's nearly at their base, which I think is going to be too little too late, quite frankly. Yeah, this is a loss. No two ways about it. But, of course, the blame grain has started. There we go. Ah, internet tanking. Don't you just love it? Oh, well done. We've managed to pull one back. Well done, that T90. Oh, no, it's uh, another 2A7. Oh. Come on, you can do it. You can... What are you doing? No, 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 no. Take him out of the game. Oh. Oh, we can say goodnight to that. Okay, we've got the T90. Uh, who is there? It's a tier 9. And he's very creaky. And the other leopard, who is also very creaky. They're not in bad positions. But at the same time, they're not going to be able to do much, and they are being advanced upon. Oh dear. Oh, double dear. There we go. A lot of PvP games in Armored Warfare go like that. Once one side starts losing, they just keep losing. Ah well, c'est la vie. First time I've taken the Leo out in PvP, and you got to remember I am the world's worst PvPer in the world ever. So what have we learnt from that? To be blunt, I'm trying to work out how all those tanks could go up one side and yet they still lose. I mean, if they'd have just really pushed it, they could have overwhelmed them. Sometimes you've got to take your balls in your hands, boys and girls. So a quick look at what we did there. I did 676 damage, which is frankly poor. Um, I earned some things there. Oh my god, really? How can I not have been last? This is what I don't understand. I'm crap. I don't know. Anyway, folks, um, I hope you've enjoyed that. Don't forget the live stream, um, twitch.tv forward slash McFadden. I'm on every night, um, as well as completetanker.co.uk. Pop over there, there's a competition going at the moment. Well, it's not really a competition, it's a giveaway. I think you just have to say something like, I like pie in a comment section, or take part in the poll, or oh, I don't know. But you don't have to make any effort, quite frankly. Um, yeah. So, hopefully tomorrow I'll be awake and I will be in a position to do a fresh video rather than having prepackaged a lot. Cheers, folks. Have fun. Toodles. <laughs>